Bissell Crosswave Cordless Max Vacuum Floor Cleaner. When we moved into our new house, we had a lot more floor space than we've ever had before. And with two kids and two dogs, I knew I needed something that was gonna really help me out to keep the floors clean. And I love this because it vacuums and cleans the floor at the same time. So you don't have to go over the floor twice. So we have this right here in our office, which is where it sits on its charging station. So it, everything is conveniently put together here in one spot. You have your rollers where you'll put them to dry after you use them, which you can easily lift it up like this. And you can see it sits right back on top of this device right here. That's what gets it charging. So put it back on. And you hear the little beep to let you know that it is on the stand properly. So when you're getting ready to use it, you will start by just getting one of your rollers, which I could definitely use some new ones. You just slip it right in here and you take the lid and there you go, pop it into place. So when you are ready to start using it, one of the things that you're going to do is fill up the reservoir here in the back with water. You just easily pop it back out, flip it upside down, and it shows you if you're wanting a large area that you have to do, you follow the guides right here, water and the formula, the cleaning formula. And then you screw this back on and put it back into the device. Pops in right there, super easy. And then on the front, what happens is once you start cleaning, the dirty water goes into this reservoir right here. So you can see in this particular reservoir, it comes undone to be able to open it. When you have the dirty water in here, when you're ready to clean it out, you can pull up the strainer right here and that'll keep all the gook separate from the water so you can throw this in the garbage and then the water you can um, dispose of in the toilet. But all that goes right in here. And then that's it. Let's take a closer look at the buttons on the vacuum. So here you have the power button and then you have the button that toggles back and forth between doing an area rug or hardwood floors. And then you have all of the options here. It says remove before use, but I've actually kept the sticker on just so I can remember what all the options are because when you take it off, it's just, it just doesn't show you a whole lot of what is on there. So I like to just remember it. So I kept my sticker on. Um, this tells you when the dirty tank is full. This tells you your battery life and then Wi-Fi. And then if you're on the area rug or the hard floor cleansing. And then when you're finished with the vacuum and when you put it back on the uh, charging base, you'll be ready to clean. And this is what you press to start the cleaning process.